Hey, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for tuning in. Today's video is going to be a Adobe Premiere Pro Creative Cloud. Um, kind of a, not really a tutorial, but some of the features that are available within that suite that you may find useful for your own drone footage. I was originally going to shoot on a bridge. I don't know if you can see it. No, you can't see it. There's a bridge behind me here that apparently had caught fire. So I'll show a picture here, but I don't know what happened to the bridge, but that was going to be my original uh, shooting location, but clearly that's not an option today. So um, yeah, what I, what I recently did was switched over, I recently switched over from Adobe Premiere Elements 14 um, to Adobe Premiere Pro Creative Cloud 2018. So I'm just now really starting to get familiar with how to use the tool and some of the edits that I think others may find useful for their drone footage as well. Uh, again, if you follow my channel, you know my name's Ron and I shoot a lot of footage with the DJI Spark and DJI Mavic Air. And in my previous video, I tried to do a tutorial and copied what Peter McKinnon had done uh, just so I could get familiar with the footage. Some of the guys called me out on it and it wasn't a big mystery that I was copying what Peter was doing. He's got 2.2 million followers. It was more or less for me to see if I could uh, do a tutorial and follow the format and see how it looked doing the same things that Peter had done and using the tools and the screensavers captures just to see just to see what it would look like because I may want to do some future tutorials of my own and I just wanted to kind of walk through the process so I've only done two or three videos so far fully cut over to Adobe Premiere Pro Creative Cloud and like I said these are some of the edits that you can do within that suite if you're not familiar with it and I thought, like I said, others may find it useful to see uh, what might be possible if they're not using this particular um, software, but perhaps you're interested in um, what, what can be done with it. So what I'm gonna do on this one, instead of doing a, a tutorial for each one that I uh, put into this video, I'll put links below and you can check them out that'll take you to other YouTube creators that have done these tutorials um, and can walk you through the process. So again, um, more or less just showing what's capable with the software and if you're interested um, in seeing how the tutorials, so seeing the tutorials themselves, there's a bunch of them out there, but I'll put a couple links below and you can check those out. If you are interested in these edits or more information on them, please leave comments below and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. And if you're an active subscriber, I thank you. If you're not an act active subscriber, please think about subscribing. And until next time, happy flying.